Sasa Matter segment tonight is coming Thursday on the Fox Business Network. John Sasa has a special about liberalism in Hollywood entitled, I Play One on TV. Some celebrities say socialism will fix everything. Socialist egalitarian system. And more laws will stop gun violence like that in... Newtown. Tucson. Aurora. But what do those same celebrities do for money? Aren't they hypocrites? I wish someone would confront them. Mr. Redford, isn't it deplorable that you're glamorizing the weather underground, a bunch of domestic terrorists? I'm speaking for the entire world. Vote for President Obama. You can't buy anything more effective. What makes these people experts? Here now is Stossel. So you're pretty brutal on these guys, huh? Well, some deserve it. Who? Leonardo DiCaprio says he's going to take some time off from films now to travel, to fly around the world trying to help the environment. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> to fly around the world? Well, maybe he's going to hang glide. I don't think so. How Harrison Ford, yeah. he owns seven airplanes. Yeah. He gets his chest waxed. Here it is. Yeah. For the rainforest. He yeah. says in this commercial, he's going to protect the rainforest. It hurts when they cut the trees down just as it hurts when they pull the hair off his chest. All right. But Harrison Ford waxing his chest, I guess they gave money to do that or something. No, I'm sure. He and he's going to volunteer. And, he, and he's going to do it for the rainforest. That's not a bad thing. I mean, the rainforests are helpful to the planet, right? But if he's going to preach environmentalism and have seven airplanes. You know, well, aren't they, maybe they're little planes, though. Well, I, they probably are. But his answer. <laughs> General aviation only contributes 2% to greenhouse gases. But these guys can't. I See, uh, look, the, the, one of the things you have in your special is they're clueless. And I, I agree 100%. That we, uh, when we ask these people on the program, they inevitably don't come on because they know they can't stand up. And they're going to look like idiots. However, you can't, if somebody wants to help the environment or help pollution, you can't say, well, you can't ever do anything that's going to be anti-environmental. I mean, that's just not fair. Um, they got to live their lives. Now, somebody like Al Gore, who makes a lot of money on it and then whips around a private jet and has all this air conditioning Huge in his mansion. Huge houses. That, everybody knows he's a hypocrite. Right. All right. Everybody knows that's wrong. But, I, you know, a guy like Harrison Ford, I don't know him, but if he wants to help the rainforest and he likes to put around a little plane, I don't, I don't have a beef with him. Now, do you feel that these people, Leonardo DiCaprio and all the other people that you have in your special, did anybody listen to them? Anybody over the age of 25 listen to them? Probably not. Okay. But look, on fracking, which has been one of the best things for the environment in America, Lady Gaga has 30 million Twitter followers. People listen to her. She doesn't even know what fracking is. She thinks it's a clothing fracking store. Fracking is banned in this state because of people well, like that's her because getting their supporters. Governor Cuomo, a Democrat, doesn't want to go up against the liberal environmentalists. And the liberals follow the celebrities. But the celebrities, I don't think the celebrities set the agenda. They're just like lemmings. Right. So somebody but they push. They help push it a little bit. Th they help spread the propaganda. Right. There's no doubt they do right. that. That's true. Okay, but they're not the driving force. They take their orders. I mean, you know, Puff Daddy isn't exactly writing policy papers here. You know, what I'm talking about Stossel. P. Diddy says, turn out light bulbs, and he's got five houses. It's just a <laughs> yeah, and they're not me. dark. <laughs> Look, just just his clothing he could light up the house though now he's dressing more conservative though but all right okay so we'll watch on uh, on thursday night good Stossel. wake up right back